Anytime. Hello, I'm Ted Hendricks of the Los Angeles Raiders. Ted Hendricks was, in my mind, if not the best outside linebacker, the most complete outside linebacker, coverage, pass rushing, intelligence, playing the run, the whole nine yards. I think LT's the best I've ever seen. Ted is right there. Over his 15-year career with the Colts, Packers, and Raiders, it was a tall order for any offense to contain six foot seven inch Ted Hendricks. The player known as the Mad Stork and kick him in the head Ted could seemingly do anything. Whether playing the run, the pass, or blocking more kicks than any player in history. It's blocked to the middle, Raiders after the ball. The four-time Super Bowl champion was a man of many teams, many names, and many adventures. I remember Ted Hendricks addressing a group of Hispanics off the balcony of his hotel about five in the morning in fluent Spanish. Ted Hendricks is someone who rode on the practice field on a white horse and another time in camp sat one of those, you know, tables that you see at a Mexican restaurant with the umbrella and had a pitcher of margaritas. There's a Renaissance Fair every year in California, and I like to collect my mask every year. I'll wear them driving down the street in the car, and you get some very uh, interesting looks from different people, kind of like stare at you, you know, I wonder what kind of human beings behind that mask. Ted Hendricks was one of the smartest guys I've ever been around. <laughs> in business, in television, in football. Ted would come in on Monday morning, hung over from the night before, or maybe it was just a, a, a kind of a continuation of the night before, and we would put up film of the next week's opponent. And Ted would sit there half awake and call out the play they were going to run before they ran it. And I'm, as a young player, you're sitting there and you're saying to yourself, how does he know all the answers? Well, he played for Don Shula with the Colts. He's, I mean, the guy's seen every offensive formation and every variation since that time. I remember one time we were playing Miami and they sent someone to crack back on Ted on a sweep that way. And Ted was just so insulted that Don had called that play and, and that Don thought that Ted might not recognize the play and Ted is yelling at Don Shula on the sideline. Don, that's an insult. You can't run that play. I saw that in 71. I've studied the game long enough to know the different blocking techniques that I have to deal with. I've seen it so many times during my career that it just comes natural. There's not very much uh, work involved in it. Ted was a guy who you could line up next to. He would say, look, they're in far formation. I want you to slant inside. That wasn't the huddle call. We'd make the play, get back in the huddle. Ted would say to me, look, when you go in your meeting, you blame it on me. And when I go in my meeting, I'll blame it on you. Ted went where Ted wanted to go. That was the magic of Ted Hendricks. <laughs> 